vacation day five. Okay, so of course Steve got me up that morning and carried me in here to my mom's room. And I slept until about 9, 9.30 because today was our sleeping day. Because we didn't have anything to do in the morning. And in the afternoon we get to go rafting. So I, we got up, we had biscuits, bacon and eggs, Grandma fixed that. And then we just, hmm. and then we went down to the shop, and I pitched to Kate, and we played with the balls, and did that kind of stuff. And we played, and the cousins and Jeff played a little bitty kickball game, and I finished typing my email that morning, and then everybody except for Papa and me and Steve and my mom stayed here while everybody else took a ride around town in FJ. And then after they left, then everybody that was left at the house, Steve, Mom, me, went to the store and Papa stayed home. And we bought some chicken and we got stuff for the last three days that we're gonna stay. It was pretty good time at the store. We just kinda did the store and we got this really good chicken. It was pretty good. And then for lunch, we um, we ate the chicken and the rolls and the watermelon. Watermelon was for me because I was so excited for watermelon. And uh, we looked like a bunch of black people eating off of the trailer outside eating chicken and watermelon. Yeah. It was weird. But it was good chicken. We had lots and lots of leftovers. Yeah, so then everybody, except for Papa, because he was still feeling bad, decided to go. We were going rafting. Everybody was so excited. This was the day that everybody's been waiting for. Okay, so we drive to Hoback, and we pick up the raft, and we get on this bus. And this bus takes us and a bunch of other families to the place where we were going to drop off and get on the Snake River. Okay, so we meet this family that is from Sherman, Texas, and we talk to them a little bit and blah, 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 on the bus. And then once we finally get there, we, our family, nine of us, are going with that three other, well, one lady and two 14-year-olds, maybe. And they're going to ride on this huge raft with us. Well, I had to, I decided that I was going to paddle. I was a little worried. Actually, I was really scared at the beginning because I was pretty sure I was going to fly off. But I didn't fly off, just to let you know. And so all the adults and me paddled, and Frankie and Peyton sat in the very, very top front part of the raft. And Cade sat in the middle, but once we started going, our um, guide's name was Jeff. And Jeff was a really nice guy, and he was awesome. And so we started rafting, but we first hit rapids as soon as we got on. So it just all of a sudden we got started doing rapids, and Kate got really scared. He was crying. He cried for at least 30 minutes. And finally, about then, he started smiling and, you know, getting more into it. And when we hit the lunch counter in the Big Kahuna were the two huge rapids. And Grandma was warning him about it. And they were like, well, they're going to take our picture here while we're doing this. So keep smiling, you know. And he's like, those are the big ones? Oh, that's nothing. So he was all happy about that. And he was fine after that. I mean, he didn't like, was all over jumping in the water like everybody else. But after we did that, he was fine. Everybody was happy. But the picture lady, he goes, Jeff, our guide, was like, "Is that that's my, don't admire the camera lady too much because that's my future fiancé. And so then he said nice things about her. And then he said something about people that don't shave. I don't know what those people are called, but he talked about people that didn't shave. And like he said, like... And while in Jackson, men are men and women and women are men or something. I don't know. Something about how women don't shave in Wyoming or something. I don't know. Don't ask me. And so then 
Jeff asked him a question, and he goes, oh, yeah, I just learned her name yesterday. That's what Jeff the guide said, so I was confused. Whatever happened then. And so we went over to some more rapids. Everybody was doing good. Everybody was happy. I did not fall out of the boat. Um, I was doing good. I was paddling well. I kind of kept hitting other paddles and hitting the other lady and splashing everybody. Yeah, and then we had a water fight with the other paddles, and I had to go to the restroom twice, and I couldn't stop laughing. And everybody was watching me go to the restroom. I mean, I still had pants on and everything. And since the water was so cold, it was 57 degrees. If you got underwater and got, got into the water to right here, then you get this bracelet that you on the Snake River water swim team. And Kate even did it. Frankie, Peyton, and me did it. And then the two other younger girls. And that was cool. So we just had a blast on the rafts. And then we took the bus back. And we got back in, our, in, our, in the car. And we came back home. And me and Kate played some more baseball. And then we decided to do this, start building things with these a little... Um, little wood and we built this cool like ball thing and it was really cool i'll have to show you that next time i do the video it's really cool and so then frankie and peyton came and decided to join themselves after they took a shower because we got soaking wet on the rafts and so then frankie and peyton came and they started doing tickets and then we started doing a carnival and me and Cade. We it was called the Cade's Arcade, and then we and then me and Cade were the Cadenators, and we were like we were the dance team, and we were dancing on the trailer, and we were like and Cade was rapping, and I started rapping, and I had spit coming all down me from rapping. I cannot, cannot rap, and so then Steve made his special spaghetti, like gourmet, but I didn't. I just had you know regular sauce and noodles, and that was pretty much our day and we had lots of fun at the carnivals we had different games and that was very fun and if some people came we got some tickets and we're ready to start a new day and last night Frankie and Peyton and Kate slept on the tent outside and it was a very it's a cool tent they just slept on the slept on the little balcony outside and that was our day today Wyoming vacation day five bye love y'all so much